Okay, we're going to go through how to set up a scan to email on our copier. So first, let's go create us an email. We're going to go to gmail.com. We're going to go to create an account. We'll call this account test email. Let's see if that one doesn't look like it's taken. Um, you're going to type in your own credentials here, but we're going to use test email for copier at gmail.com. Our password, we're going to enter our password. You, can, you have the option of using your current email address um, as your backup or your mobile phone. you're going to agree to that continue to Gmail now this right here is a vital step if not your copier will not email we're going to go over to let this process so we're going to go over to my account and you're gonna look for allow less secure apps turn that on that's under sign in and security and that is creating a gmail Now let's go ahead and add our Gmail to our copier. So we're going to type in our address for our Lexmark. We're going to go over here to links and indexes, email settings, set up email server. Primary SMTP gateway will be smtp.gmail.com. Our port will be 465. We're going to use our Gmail that we created for our reply address. Use SSL TLS required. SMTP server authentication, login plain. Device initiated email, use SMTP credentials. User initiated email, use device SMTP credentials. Device user ID will be the Gmail that we created and the password for that Gmail account submit now we're gonna go back to links and indexes email shortcut setup and let's add a shortcut we'll call this one test shortcut one and add and that is it